They're in the middle of a world tour celebrating 30 years of rocking all over the world, and they've specially taken the time out to appear on our show tonight. Please welcome, from Status Quo, Francis Rossi and Rick Parfitt. Hello Welcome there. to the show, guys. Thank you. I appreciate you taking the time out. I understand you just got off the plane from Japan. Yeah, we've yeah. just, just come from Osaka. And we're a bit jet-lagged. You are a bit uh, jet-lagged, are you? Just a touch. It's, uh, it seems to be... And you're in your hotel room there, uh, live in Sydney. And I yeah, we'll go to bed in a minute. <laughs> <laughs> About what time will that happen, boys? We'll hang around and catch that live. About an hour, hour or so. We don't know what time it'll happen, but we'll go to bed fairly soon. So, I suppose later on you'll trash the hotel room? Throw well, the... Probably, yeah. Yeah. Well, there's, the harbour is right out the back here, so um, probably throw something out the window in a while, you know, like we do. I think you should. Well, just rock and roll. Eject it out of the window. Oh, you. Well. Or me. We might now, eject some rubbish out the window. Yeah, we might eject something out the is window. Is that you? That is him, is it? Is yeah. that me? Can you, that's me. Is this, <laughs> is this? Can we just ask you? Can we just ask you? Is this, is this a syrup or...? <laughs> Yeah, at least I've still got mine there, yeah, Francis. Yeah, I was thinking, but if you didn't oh. one, would you... Yeah. No, no, that's what I look like. It's a high-cost uh, high uh, OB that we're doing here, as you can tell. Now, you boys wouldn't know this, but I myself was in a band about 20 years ago. We, we have heard, actually. Well, and we only lasted about four or five years. We and... heard you did very well. But the... <laughs> <laughs> by the end of that four or five years, we couldn't stand the sight of each other. No. Yeah, we couldn't stand the sight of you either, actually. <laughs> <laughs> how, how have you guys managed to keep together for so long? We play with each other a lot. <laughs> <laughs> On that and, and in front of people. Yeah. <laughs> are you, are you, I mean, it's a, it's a, it may seem a stupid question, but you obviously still enjoy it. Yeah, we do. We, we enjoy being on... <laughs> <laughs> We enjoy being on stage, of course we do, otherwise um, we wouldn't be doing it. It's the whole purpose of, I mean, you don't travel around the world um, because you enjoy travelling. You, you travel to do a job, to get out and entertain people, and that's what we enjoy doing. So, and we do still enjoy that, yeah. Are your audi the audiences that you attract, are they people who remember you from the old days, or are you finding young kids uh, getting into it as well? A bit of both, really. I, I, I think uh, it's nice to see a varied audience. I mean, rock and roll is, is for anybody. I mean, it, it's, it's good fun. And uh, anybody who wants to really go along and have, uh, have a good time, it, 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 it doesn't matter what age you are, really. I, I don't think so. Look at us. I mean, we're old men and we're still enjoying it. <laughs> In 1991, you did uh, win an award for an outstanding contribution to I'm British music. That. Oh, I see. Yes. You don't want to go into that? Well, Sorry, I, was going to ask I thought you were going to say something else there. Go no, on. no, no. I know you've won a few other awards as well, but we don't want to go into that. <laughs> I was going to ask you, what do you think has been your contribution to British music? I think... Uh, <laughs> mm. <laughs> Sweet. <laughs> Not much, really. Yeah. <laughs> just to try and stay together, but we just have to stay together. I think, uh, I mean, I think it's, it's longevity, really. I think if, if you've been together for as long as we have. I think the establishment is sort of bludgeoned into giving you something, you know. You know. I think you might go so away. Give us an award and say, well, that'll do them for another 20 years or whatever, you know, so they won't have to see us again. Are you still writing songs? <laughs> <laughs> yes and no, really. Yeah, we are. Yeah, we're, we're, we're in the process of uh, doing a new, writing a new album at the moment. Do you, do you find that, do you find that hard work, writing? I find it hard in the morning, but I used to do that anyway, so... <laughs> <coughs> What do you think of uh, what do you think of contemporary music? Smashing. <laughs> no, really. <laughs> Honestly, some, I mean, I think it's like it always is. Some of it is good, some of it isn't. It depends on, on taste as well. Some people think something's crap. Some people think something's great. And well, that, well that's, that's a brilliant uh, answer. That, yeah, well, that's, that's a yeah. answer. That's that's a stock answer. Stock that, answer, that, answer that, yeah. Yeah. Stock well, answer. I mean, as a man more or less from your era, I find that most. <laughs> um, we'll get around to that that most modern music is a rehash of what did yes, happen in yeah. the 60s and 70s. Would you, you agree with that? You feel, listening to uh, a lot of the new stuff, I mean, not knocking it, but you, knocking you feel it. that you, you, you have heard it all before. A lot of it is particularly a spin-off from the Beatles and stuff like that. But, I mean, if the youngsters these days haven't heard that, then it's all new to them, so fair enough. Do you think you've influenced modern bands? <laughs> I very much doubt that somehow. I don't know. Maybe, maybe in, in, in some sort of way we have. I mean, just in the length of time we've been around. I mean, you know, a lot of people have obviously listened to us, but I, I wouldn't really say that we, we've influenced anybody, really, would you? Because well, we're, we're not that sort of influential type band, really. You know, no three chords. 
All right, so people who, who only know three cars. like a pork chop. Yeah, it's sure it's wet again, <laughs> isn't it? Yeah. People who come along to the shows, then they can expect a traditional status quo show. We might even throw an extra call, don't you, Rick? We think. Maybe. Nah, but... Yeah, they, they can, really, yeah. I mean, um, all the stuff from over the last sort of 50, 60 years, how long is it now? <laughs> well, yeah, it'll, it'll, it'll be in there. Here's your big chance, Francis. Grab a hold of that CD, because if they don't go along to the show, they can buy the CD, What's which that? is status quo, oh. rocking all over Australia, 1997. Fancy finding that there. <laughs> and in our room, on our bed. <laughs> The boys are in Tweed Heads tomorrow, then they're in Brisbane, Sydney, Melbourne, Adelaide, Canberra. Check your local and guys and we'll just thank Status Quo. Thank you, boys. Thank you.